So I have blue-eyed lemon pleco fry. Um, and because I was afraid that the killifish in the tank with the plecos were going to eat the babies, I pulled him out and put him in a critter keeper, which means we'll be changing water every night. But I've got some green beans in there. Um, last time I had fried, I didn't feed them enough. And watch over them close enough. I didn't want to pull daddy, so I pulled the whole cave. I've got fake plants in there from another tank that should have all kinds of crap on them. I've got the cave that was in the tank with him. Um, there's rocks in here. The side of the thing, this is where my Shelly has been recoup had been recuperating for the last month. So there's biofilm that they can eat and gunk on the sides. Um, they're very tiny. And of course I can't get it to focus on them because you know they're so tiny. But they're all over. They're on the the air tube. Can I see them running along the air tube? They're on the side. Both sides. And in front of them is, is the critter keeper uh, with my better snowflake who's no matter what I've done, fans will not heal. Um, we're going through the erythromycin and I, and um, salt again. But here's another one of them on the other side. Like I said, I put tacky fake plants in here, but they were in an, another tank and they've been in there for months. So they should have all kinds of gunk on them. Um, there's some more over on the back side and on the heater. So I'm excited. I want to make sure they don't die. So I have gotten a lot of cans of green beans so far. They don't know that they're food. I guess instinct has you just rasping on the sides of things maybe. I don't know. But the last round of fry I have, I lost a lot of them. And I think it's because I didn't put enough vegetables in there and I didn't have them in something where they weren't having to compete with so many other things for food. So we've got them with Papa in here. I don't think daddy will eat them. He's been guarding them really well. So I didn't want to pull him away from them. I left him in here. Try to feed him some more too. I've got some zucchini I'll put in there tomorrow night and get him some zucchini in there and fatten him up again. So he's still in the cave. Yeah, you can see when the babies, the babies right on the glass. But anyway, I'm excited. It's always exciting to have fry. So I have, now I have a Pistagrama VA, the Vegeta fry. It's like V-I-E-G-J-I-T-A or something. I don't know how to say it, but I have them in a tank. And now I have these little lemon blue eyed plecos. So, of course, I always have um, guppy fry because, you know, it's guppies. I think that's it for now. She just, it's exciting. It's always exciting to have babies. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And it's back to work for a lot of us tomorrow. Take care. Wash your hands. Stay safe. Catch you later.